Breaking news. Governor Sanwo Olu denies appointing MC Olumo as Lagos Transport Parks GM. That's general manager. You know, this morning, um, Lagos State Government has also, I mean, trying to uh, make the matter diffuse the tension, has, you know, uh, detached or rather says the national body of NURTW should not come to um, Lagos State and they should allow MC Olumo, you know, uh, and MC Olumo himself, by himself, has removed the whole of Lagos, okay, from the body saying that um, they are now an association on their own. And, and you know that um, this guy has a big part to play in terms of, uh, you know, in terms of election, how he rolls with Ashiwajo Ahmed Bola Tenobo. Now the report has gone viral that um, the Lagos State Governor Babajide Sangwolu has appointed him as the general manager since this whole um, issue began. But um, the governor of... Um, of Lagos State says, well, I don't know what you're talking about. So there is no such uh, discussion, appointment being given by me. You see, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Governor Sanwolu denies appointing MC Olumo as Lagos Transport Park GM. The press secretary of Governor Sanwolu debunk the news that they have appointed MC Olumo as the GM of Lagos Parks. Governor Babajide Sanwolu has dismissed reports on the proposed appointment of Saliu Akinsoye, aka called MC Olumo, as the head of Lagos Transport Park and Garages Management Committee. Recall that the Union, National Union of the Road Transport Workers, NURTW, suspended him indefinitely as the Lagos chairman on Wednesday. On Thursday, the sanctioned leader announced that he and the state chapter are breaking away from the body. Olumo urged Governor Sangwolu to appoint a management committee to oversee the operations of the park. On Friday, information emerged that Akin Soye has been named, that is MC Olumo, has been named as the head of Lagos Transport Park and Garage Management Committee. Reacting, Boyega, Sanwolu's chief press secretary, debunked the news. Please disregard polls claiming that Governor Babajide Sanwolu has appointed suspended chairman of the NURTW, MC Olumo, as GM Lagos Transport Park and Garage Committee, he tweeted. The spokesman noted that the statement by Information Commissioner Benga Omotoshon remains that the gov remains the, on the government's position than the governor's position on what is going on, that the governor just wants to diffuse the current tension ongoing with relates to with relations to the um, you know the tense atmosphere being experienced because of the transport union and all that is going on right now. So this is what is happening. MC Olumo um, news broke out that um, he's he's gotten the opportunity to be crowned okay he's gotten the opportunity to be crowned as the one who will be deciding what happens next going forward but news report reaching us is that 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 may not be the case and uh, that may be different altogether yes he has urged the governor to appoint but the governor did not appoint him this is the governor saying that okay this is the governor saying that and so this is what is happening so in case you are one of those who is parading the information that um, he has been appointed as the general manager because MC Olumo has done well to say they are breaking away from the Lagos chapter and what have you. However, way they've broken up, you know, but um, he has not been appointed to oversee, you know, to oversee this very uh, body. So this is what is going on, my wonderful people. And then we thought to bring you up to speed as the matter continues to unfold. A single man took a whole body out of, you know, the union. And why, I cannot tell you. But, you know, the man himself is telling you that uh, I, I myself, I am the one, you know, I'm the one who caused the shot. You know, I'm the one who caused the shot. 
So this is what is happening right now. And as you can see, Nigerians, uh, you know, we, we, we must continue to speak out against, you know, every, every un, un, unfair thing being done in our society around us we must continue to speak against it because currently all that is going on clearly shows to us you know that um, we cannot continue to deceive ourselves that all is well there is clear indication that um, you know politically speaking some persons have taken it as beating more they can chew okay a beating the beating more they can more than they can chew MC Olumo, you know, according to the national body, you know, has, be, has been accused of insubordination. But he's saying, well, I did not uh, commit any form of crime or whatever. Whatever you are saying, I don't, uh, I don't get it. I am only saying that uh, the, the union, uh, I'm the one in charge. And you, if you want to do something else, nobody can wake up one morning and become the tricycle uh, just in head. This is what is bringing the whole world out. This is the main crux of the matter because someone was appointed as the head of tricycle, uh, you know, in Lagos saying that the, it should not be monopolized. Yeah, that, uh, you know, they should get the, the matter should also include, okay, they should divide the road transport working and they, they should divide it between them and also um, the other places they should divide it. This is where the problem is. So. This is where the problem lies. This is where the problem lies, that they should divide it. And somebody said, no, you can't divide it. I'm here to stay. You don't have a choice. I must. That's, that's the problem. Okay? I'm, that's the problem. This is the real problem going on now. So, my wonderful people, we must continue to speak out. Okay? He said, uh, Sam Olu cannot appoint MC Olumo as Lagos uh, management, uh, you know, head. It is unheard of. Okay, contrary to the ma message being posted out there, said no, it's not true. Contrary to that, it's not true. Nobody appointed him to be to take over the management of the park. Okay, so this is what is happening, and then we'll keep you up to date. And um, as the matter unfolds, remember that every one of us must continue to speak out, you know, on matters and issues going on. So at the end of the day, we have, you know better opportunity and um, we, we have the right persons in, po in position. We must continue to speak out against wrongdoing in our society. God bless you. Have a good day. From us, it's bye for now. Bye.